Bless Gala, I was invited for a meetup by my friend. I discovered the meetup was uh, sponsored by GIZ and then in partnership with uh, NEFTEC. So while in this meetup, I discovered it was uh, about IoT and they talked about uh, sensors, sensors like soil moisture sensors and humidity sensors, temperature sensors. And uh, personally, I like agriculture. I'm into agriculture and they were talking about sensors that could monitor and control things on agriculture. I mean, monitor farm uh, temperatures about farm. So I was like, I could invest in this uh, I could like tap from this knowledge and then use it in uh, this agriculture I'm really interested in. So I did extra research and then I was able to come up with this project. This project you see here is an interactive uh, soil plant, plant monitoring system. So it can monitor soil uh, humidity, can monitor soil texture, soil moisture, it can monitor temperature of the farm. And then it can also detect movement in the farm. So I would just like to do a small demo about the project. So here we have a, a soil moisture sensor. Here we have a water that I'm using as a pump. Here we have the plant itself. There is soil inside. Here we have a, the display. It is interactive because you can know at what state the plant is even without using your mobile device that you have gotten to give you the data. And then here we just have the power source. All right, I'm going to power the device now, the pump. I'm going to power the pump now. Oh, so when I power the pump, you discover that the pump was on because it was dry. So if I had to put the soil moisture sensor inside water, discover that it stops pumping. It's showing that the soil moisture is uh, good. Now, if I remove the soil moisture sensor from water, that is the soil moisture is uh, not up to standard. It has to, on the, it has to on the pump again and it continues pumping water like it just did. So to stop it, you just have to make sure the soil is properly uh, moisturized and it stops the pump from sending power. So that is how the project functions. There are extra LEDs to indicate to you on the app uh, how the movement about the farm is. Um, on the app, you see it sends you the data gotten from this farm. And that was what I had to do about this project. Thank you all.